Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another Iron Man Progress video. This is episode number 54. Um, kicking things off with a hard clue that I got from a Dark Beast task. So let's see if we can get anything good from that. Nope, but uh, fingers crossed that's not a sign of things to come for this episode. Um, hope you guys enjoy watching. Was a few thousand XP off the level, so I thought I'd quickly knock that out. And that is 91 Herb Lore. Um, in terms of other things I've got left to unlock, I think the only really useful one is possibly super anti-fire potions, but I can boost for that easily, so... Alright, well I decided there's no point putting it off. Um, I had the materials, or the food, whatever you want to call it, in the bank for 99 cooking, so as soon as these wines uh, ferment, that will be enough. And I'm hoping this isn't going to take too long, so I actually don't really know how long the XP drop takes to come and this is getting slightly awkward. 99 cooking. I think that's the third 99 on the account. HP was first, strength and now cooking. Um, I will go and pick up the cape. Um, I think it will essentially replace the chef's hat that I've got in the bank that gives me entrance to the cook's guild. Um, I can't get rid of the um, cooking gauntlets unfortunately because I do need those for a follow the bard step but um, yeah I mean the cape's not the most useful I'll use it for um, cooking anything that still can be burned at 99 because the cape essentially means you don't burn anything I'm not sure which foods you can still burn at 99 it might be crown bonds I don't really know to be honest but um, yeah nice to knock that one out hey another archer's ring that's pretty cool that's my third one I swear they've gone up in value since the last video. I think the second archer's ring I got was uh, like 5.2 mil. Still no sick or nothing for me. Yes, I got the torn prayer scroll finally. One prayer left to go. All right, let's activate this bad boy. Not too sure where I'll use it, but um, useful to have. There is preserve. Coming in with 78 wood cutting, many levels left to go. Got a master clue from uh, doing a few mediums and managed to complete it. Let's see if we can get anything good. Ooh, two U seeds, that's pretty good. And some nice supplies, 460K, not too bad. And another Berserker Ring. Um, I think that's the third one, possibly the fourth. Um, still no Warrior Ring. Got another hard clue for not too much. A Granite Longsword. They're worth a lot more than I thought. Um, I'm not too sure how they're how rare they are from uh, these Wyverns, but um, doesn't really have much use for me, but pretty cool to get, I guess. Hard clue, what can we get? Nunchucks, not had that before. Um, definitely unique. I think my recorder might have frozen and messed up the clip there, but um, let's try these on. Oh, they look pretty cool. Hopefully they'll go in the house. Got an elite clue. What can we get? I'll take that to uh, two tree seeds. That's pretty decent. Nearly 300k reward. Got a hard clue. Uh, coming in with 79 wood cutting. Um, I really do want to knuckle down and get 87 as quickly as possible before the Kebos Lowlands update. So I think I'm pr pretty much just going to focus on woodcutting. Might take breaks to do the clue scrolls that I get from the bird's nest from time to time. But um, yeah, it'd be good to knock this one out. Speaking of which, I do have a hard and an elite clue. So let's see if we can get anything good. Yeah, not bad. Let's see what the elite clue has for us. Uh, nothing too special there. There we go, and that is 80 wood cutting. So rune crafting is actually my only skill under 80 now. Um, I will have to train it at some point for the diaries, but um, not too sure when that will be exactly. There is 81. There's 82. Hard and an elite this time. Ooh, master clue. Uh, let's go and give that a go. All right, managed to complete it. What can we get? Yeah, decent amount of room bars, I guess. Can't quite see how much that's worth. I think it's about 300k. And that is my 13th master clue. Found a cheeky little dragon impling. Can we get anything good? Oh, not really. 
there's 83 and that is 84 wood cutting and that is 85 wood cutting which I guess technically is the uh, bare minimum that I would need to be able to do the new diary and um, cut red woods for master clue steps whatever because I can use a plus five boost but I think I will uh, aim to get 87 before the diary is released just because then it's going to be so much easier just to use a dragon axe spec to uh, to get that plus three boost um, but I might go and do something a little bit different now head back to Slayer for a bit because um, yeah still got plenty of time to get those last two levels coming in with 97 attack on this uh, superior nothing too special in terms of drops though hey there we go another whip drop always good to see all right got a hard clue and an elite can we get anything good no no not really I do like those teleports though hey a dragon plate skirt from a steel dragon um, kinda cool to see I know like plate skirts and plate legs are pretty common from uh, Vorkath and stuff like that, so I'm going to end up with tons of these on the account, but hey, that was the first kill of the task as well, so that's pretty cool. Hey, another archer's ring. Um, Still no circle. And yet another archer's ring. Can't complain. They're worth an awful lot of money. And another ring. That's uh, my third series ring, I think. Yes, there we go. I can't believe that took 528 kills. I mean, of all the things to go dry on, it's probably not the worst. I'm still waiting on that warrior's ring, but um, that's nice. I can stick that in the stash, and um, yeah, that's uh, everything up to elite um, in terms of clues that I can do now. Just uh, a few master steps that I can't quite manage. What on earth? I just got my second prime pet within 527 kills. Oh man, that would have been so nice to get a second... DK's pet but actually from one that I needed oh my god task complete that's the first time that I've managed to complete an entire DK's task in one trip which is really nice um, and what a trip it was at that obviously wasn't expecting to get another pet slightly disappointing that it's a duplicate pet but um circle which is really good and the drops I actually want to see if um, if the second pet shows up on the uh, where would it be? Dagonoth Kings. If, want, if it shows, oh, it does. So it shows that I've had two uh, Dagonoth Prime pets. That's pretty cool. Still waiting on that Warrior Ring though. All right, hard and elite from that DK's task. Are we get anything good? No, no. Well, guys, unfortunately, that is it for today's episode. A slightly shorter one than usual. I did want to get a video out before Christmas, and it looks like I've just about managed that, which is good. Um, pretty decent episode. I think the uh, DK's trip to finish things off um, was pretty nuts. Definitely wasn't expecting that second prime pet, but um, really nice to get the circle and um, hopefully won't get stuck on too many clues going forwards in the future. Um, I would like to get another video out before the end of the year. I think uh, a progress video is probably a bit too optimistic, but I was thinking of putting together a little um, bank video and maybe sort of laying out some goals for 2019 if that would be interesting for you guys to watch um, be very happy to put that together um, but otherwise um, I hope everyone has a very nice Christmas and New Year and um, hopefully see everyone back in time for the next episode Merry Christmas guys